What's up, guys? Kidmar95 here bringing you another episode. Today's episode, folks, we have a technical analysis on District 0x, currently down to about 5% in USD value, sitting about slightly below 3.5 cents. But we're looking at the BTC value, folks, sitting at about 535 Satoshis. But really quick, before we do that, guys, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you're one of those. Love you guys, too. Appreciate the support. But let's go ahead and run through the market before we look at some charts. Market cap is sitting at 248 billion. Today's volume is 10.5 billion. Bitcoin dominance sitting at 43.2%. Bitcoin down about a quarter percent, folks, sitting at 6,250. Ethereum down one, sitting at 435. XRP down one as well, sitting at 43. Bitcoin Cash slightly down, sitting at 697. EOS is back below $7, down 2%. Litecoin also down two, sitting at 76. Lumens and Cardano, folks, for those of you that don't know. Um, actually got announced by Coinbase that they are potentials, uh, potential coins that could be added to their exchange along with BAT and uh, 0x. That's why we have BAT up 22% today, 0x up 16 and Zcash as well up almost 8% sitting at 172. Two folks came here for some District 0x. Market cap is sitting at 20 million. Today's volume is 413, uh, well, 413,000 is pretty low. Circulating supply is 600 million, total supply 1 billion. Major exchanges here, folks Binance, Bitrix, Liqui, Upbit, Mercatox, OKEX, HitBTC, and IDEX. Looks like are the major exchanges. First things first BTC to USD on the daily. Well, looks like we are forming higher lows. We are, you know, we did find support here at 6 1, forming our nice little higher lows. Let's go ahead and see what the four hours showing us. I feel like this is a fake out. If we break and close above six thousand uh, three, almost now nah, it's not six three, it's almost six three. But if we get that four hour break and close above this level, expect BTC to go from about six three, all the way up to about six four. It could possibly be forming a higher uh, high. Let's go ahead and drag this out. So we could possibly be seeing folks there's a break above this level testing here at about 6.5 and then coming back down to find support here at 6.3 if we hold here you know I, I believe the bear market might be over however if we do not hold here I think Bitcoin falls the back down to about 5,000 or to 5,000 since it hasn't been there this year just my personal opinion, I'm not a financial advisor, so don't hate me for that one. I'm not buying any BTC. I'm waiting for us to get a weekly reversal or a daily reversal. What I am doing, however, is I am out adding to my altcoin position bag. So Ethereum to USD on the daily, folks, in this nice little down aggressive downtrend. We did break out of it. Couldn't break above 492. Looks like we have a potential bo double bottom for me here. I'm not calling it a double bottom until we break and close above 447 on the daily. Once we break and close above 447 on the daily, Ethereum should be good to go. Switching over to Litecoin, same thing. Potential double bottom. Not calling it a double bottom until we break and close above $79. Once we break and close above $79, Litecoin should be good to go. But as you can tell, we're not able to break below $75 here. But if we do break below $75, expect a drop to $50. Just my personal opinion. Not a financial advisor. Point of the day though, folks. District, at, District 0x, sorry to... We're looking at Binance as our broker. We're looking at the daily as well. Beautiful price action. We're expecting our nice little bearish parallel channel. Bottom one, as you can tell, this is our major support. Broke out of it. It looks like we formed a higher high. Came as high as about 800 Satoshis. Came back down as low as 500 Satoshis. And now it looks like we have another potential double bottom forming here. We got higher low, higher low, higher low. Go ahead, switch over to the four hour really quick, see what the four hour is showing us. So the four hour is showing us we have a double double bottom for sure. This would be bottom one, this would be bottom two. But then when you zoom in on the double bottom on the right, it looks like we have a potential another double bottom forming. And we could be seeing district zero uh, X forming a higher high. Let's see if the hour is showing us anything. Yeah, it definitely looks like we found support here, folks. Actually, if you want, if you're looking to buy District 0x, now looks like it's a pretty good time to buy. 
Looks like we're just coming down to test for support. Or if you want to play it safe, wait for that break and close above 565 Satoshis. Once we break and close above 565 Satoshis, expect this expect this district 0x to start taking off. I should just say DNT. But expect DNT to start taking off. Where do I see this coin going in 2018? Currently sitting at about 535 Satoshis. You know, depending on how long this bear market lasts, I don't I don't know how much longer it's gonna last to be honest. But I think we easily come up to about 2,000 Satoshis here in 2018. If not early 2019 for sure. I'd probably say within the first two to three months of 2019. Just my personal opinion though. Remember, I'm not a financial advisor. But that's pretty much it for today's video, guys. Don't forget to re steam, upvote, keep commenting down below what kind of coins you guys are trying to see. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you guys are one of those. That's all right. Make sure you guys are commenting your coins down below. And other than that, thanks for your support. Take it easy. Peace.